past six years, I've made over $500,000 in a trading. And recently I've been mentoring more students and some of them have been making $60,000, $50,000 and even $100,000 as well. So one of the questions I asked myself was what is the three key traits in order to become a successful trader and someone on the start of their journey or someone in the middle, if they did these three things, they would be a profitable trader much quicker and be on that half a million mark much faster as well. So in this video, I'm going to be breaking down these three steps for you guys to learn and earn with over case study and how it's affected me and how it can affect you. So let's get started. So let's just jump straight into it. First things first is serious strategy. Serious strategy is broken down into two steps. Number one, the serious and number two, the strategy. Now in the serious part is a first, identify the strategy that works for you. Now, if you are a person that is impatient, then you prefer to day trade, then use that. If you like to swing trade or support and resistance, ICT, pattern A, or if you want to learn from us, whatever it is, pick a strategy and stick to it and be serious about making it work. Now, majority of the strategies in the trading community and the trading world works is the individual that doesn't. And what that means is the person just tries it for a few months, for a few years or whatever it may be, and doesn't consistently refine to make it a profitable strategy, which I'll go into in more detail in step two. So the first step is to pick a strategy and then purely understand that it's you versus you, me versus me, and do not let any of the noise affect you. So what you need to do is have the unwavering mindset that I'm going to do whatever it takes to make this strategy profitable. So once you've had that serious approach and once you've decided that you're going to do whatever it takes, this goes on to the second step, the strategy refinement. And what that is, is basically you need to constantly keep refining the strategy until it works. And you need to have a to-do list for this. So things like refining it, what is your edge? What are the training confluences that works? What is the highest probability? How do you go on tilt? how to avoid going on tilt, the psychology and the constant refinement. So then you keep refining your strategy. And how that works is say we talk about a support and resistance or a break retest, which is one of the strategies we teach, is simply put, the first revision that you have is I'm going to buy every time it hits this support or resistance. And you find over 10 trades that actually this loses majority of the time. But then on revision two, you find that what you want to do is have it test the first time, have a reaction, have a confirmation and then join in on the second test. Now, this is a refinement and this is how you increase the edge of your trading strategy and how you improve your trading strategy overall. Does that make sense? Because you've got your first revision, you find some mistakes, you find what works and what doesn't, and then you keep improving it and improving it and improving it. It's like cooking. You have these ingredients. Sometimes this time was a little bit less salt. Next time I'll put more or less. It doesn't matter. It's about cooking this ingredients to make it taste the best for you so you can enjoy it and it makes you profitable and create success in the long run. So the serious strategy actually worked for me when I took my pattern A seriously. And what I did was I said, I'm gonna make this strategy work. This is what the mentor taught me and I did everything in my power to do it. And then within a three month period, I was up overall, meaning I was profitable. And with that, that was solidified. That gave me the confidence to understand my strategy works. It gave me the confidence to know what I was doing was right. And any time I go through a down period, even to this day, I remember that period of my life, which gives me the overall fundamentals to keep pushing forward and keep persevering. So that is trait number one. Trait number two is accountability and journal. My gosh, did I wish I journaled way more at the start. And when I say journal is you can't manage what you don't measure. You can't measure what you don't manage. If you don't know what you're doing, then you're not keeping track. You don't know what you're doing right. You don't know what you're doing wrong. You can't refine and improve your overall edge. Now, what we have is something we call a to-do list, which I'm going to pop up on the screen here. Ding! And this to-do list is basically something that we constantly refine and do over and over and over again until number one, the strategy is profitable, or number two, we want to refine it to increase the edge and increase the profitability of our strategy. And how this works is things like, what is my strategy right up? How do I understand the markets? What kind of time zones am I playing in? What is a more profitable instrument for me? What time frames? What execution? What kind of entry requirements that actually make me more profitable over time? So having all of this information and all of this data collected, this then can increase your edge, understand your trading strategy and understand your business as an overall in order to accumulate more information. So something you could do is actually get a Tradezilla. So I'm actually migrating to Tradezilla at the moment. And this is the daily journal that you can fill out. You can write in your trade. You can put in the charts. You can write what you did and what you didn't do right. You can also put in the tilt factor in it as well. And because of all this data, you're able to refine and improve. So when we talk about refining, 
a prime example is Rena. When we went through her strategy and her journal, we actually reviewed that we could actually remove 39 losses from her strategy by just removing Thursdays, taking some extra precautions and removing some times in her trading. So you can see on this screenshot, if we did this, she would have saved 39 R, which is $39,000 if it's $1,000 per R. Then we've got Anton. What we found from Anton's one was a great example is he didn't, shouldn't be trading against a moving average. As soon as he implemented that, boom, he became profitable and then went on to withdrawing $27,000 in less than two months. So this is key. So you need to constantly stay accountable and stay up to date with your journal. Now, if you do want to, don't forget to check out our applications down below if you want to apply to for our yearly course on our yearly program. And what this is, is basically you get our A to Z course in trading on our swing trading and day trading strategy. And then you have a yearly access on your journal where you keep refining and refining and refining and access to our webinars to help you become a profitable trader within a year. The third and final trait is the compound effect. If you can't make $10, you can't make a thousand, you can't make a hundred thousand step by step. So you need to understand that if I can consistently make $100 or 2R or 3R over a three month period, you just need to rinse and repeat. And over a year, you'll be doubling that three years doubling that and you will increase the risk to award, but the percentage is the same. And then you will start in turn making more money. That's exactly what it was for me. I said to myself, I just want to make $5. That's it. $5. And then five, 10, 15, 20, right? Then it goes to 40, then 80, 160, 320, 640, and then 1,080. And then we start getting more into these higher numbers where it could be life changing. But that's the thing, don't rush to the process because if you make it quick, you will lose it quick. So understand the compound effect. What I encourage you is to read a book called The Compound Effect by Darren Hardy and really implement that into your life and into your trading. This really helped me solidify taking it slow and being the turtle as opposed to the hare. You will get there. You'll be there on your own journey is you versus you and me versus me so i hope you guys enjoyed the video these are the three traits that i genuinely believe that can absolutely change your life and change your trading and it helped me to get to where i am now to understand that you have a serious strategy by taking your strategy seriously and having that unwavering mindset number two is to have the accountability and journal and obviously joining something like our winner's circle program and then last but not least our compound effect which is understanding is about the long journey and it's about the process and the results will come so i hope you guys enjoyed the video remember to like share and subscribe if you don't mind please share this on twitter because we're trying to grow our youtube channel up to the 100k mark and i appreciate every single one of you so thanks for watching like share and subscribe check out the links below and see you in the next video peace out